Hey guys, Paul here. This is uh, episode 64 of my Sniper Only Road to Commander series. <coughs> uh, yes, indeed. Episode 64. <coughs> right. So, uh. Well, I random kill from the game. Why not? Just a random, random game. Yes. As you uh, might have seen last episode, I was doing really bad because my aim was off. I had not played in a couple days, so, you know, my aim was very not good. Here's the AS50. So, uh, in between the uh, episodes, I actually went into a private match and just quick scoped some walls and stuff just to get my aim back on a little bit. And, uh, you know, this is my first multiplayer game since then, and hopefully it actually does help. So, yes. Yeah. But then again, it might not. Maybe my aim is still just as bad, who knows. <laughs> I didn't do it very much. Uh, I just walked around and I quick scooping some of the chickens in Sea town Yep. Oh, sheesh. Because whenever you start a private, well, we go into a private match lobby, it actually puts Sea town as the first map, which, wow, good spawn game. I actually put Sea Town as the first map, and I don't understand why that is. I mean, usually it shows the first map alphabetically in all the previous Call of Duties, like in Black Ops, it was Array, and then in uh, World of War, I believe, is Airfield or something. And sheesh, Modern Warfare 2, I don't even know. But COD 4, don't even really remember. But, you know, <clears throat> whatever. Actually, I don't even know if it was, like, all the Call of Duty previously that did that. All I know is that Black Ops did that. And I think World of War, but I'm not positive about that one. All I remember for sure is Black Ops, when they started a private match lobby, it automatically put the map on Array. That's because it was the first one out of all the maps alphabet alphabetically. But obviously, Seaton is not the first one alphabetically, because, well, it starts with an S, and the map I'm playing right here is Arkadin. Which begins with an A, and this one, I believe, should actually be first. Oh, sheesh. Man, these spawns are really sucking right now. I don't know why the spawns are just doing so bad right now. Oh, sheesh. Sheesh, that was terrible. Okay, so uh, forget that about me, actually. Well, my aim actually being better this time. It probably is not much better since last game. But it is getting a little bit better, I think, since since the first game I played today. Because this is just my third game in a couple days, and... Yeah, sheesh. Oh my gosh. So many people. So, yeah, my aim is probably not going to be that good in it still. Nice little AS-50 spray right there. Not really. That was kind of an ugly spray, but who cares. Ooh! Oh, sheesh, sheesh, I guess getting shot in the back, and then shot in the front by that guy, and then... <sighs> yeah, not good. Oh, sheesh, good spawn. Loki, or lo Loli Girls, what, what kind of a dumb name is that? Why would you call yourself that? L Loli Girls, what, what is this? That's, I don't even know. No comment. I just, I just don't even know what to say about that, that's just weird. Well, that's mean something that I don't know, and then people are going to think I'm weird for not knowing what that means or something, but whatever. I don't care. That was a nice subtle panic knife, probably. Yes. Not really. That probably wasn't a panic knife. But I don't care. I call it one anyways, because I like to. Jeez, I'm terrible right now. There we go. Nice little throw knife. Well, at least my aim with the throwing knives is better than my sniper. There we go. Oh, sheesh. <laughs> uh. Alright, at least you can tell I'm gradually getting my aim back. I'm sure within a couple games I'll be back to normal aiming abilities. Chase EMP. I hate how those blind me. They are annoying. I actually get blinded by EMPs. I really dislike that. It's like a. Oh, I forgot I have <sighs> They actually like blind everyone on the map, and it's actually really annoying. 
really annoying. I know I've complained about that probably in the series like ten times already, but you know, it annoys me every time it happens. Okay, well, not a very good first game. But I did Whatever. Well, I mean, third game. Third game of the day. First game of this episode. But hey, you know, my first first few games of the day, I'm not very, usually very good. So, I just need to warm up, get my aim back on. And then I'll be back to owning noobs like normal. I suppose throwing knife kills. I only got like one, but okay. Most UAVs, most bullet penetration kills, most sniper kills, most scoped kills. Cool. I don't feel like playing in that lobby. Let's go to ground war. Like some ground war. That lacks me that ground war. Ooh, resistance. My least favorite. No, second least favorite. No, hard hat's the worst, but hard hat doesn't actually show up in ground war because it's too small, so this is my least favorite for ground war. Ugh. And hey, whatever. 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 <coughs> Gonna use the AS50 again. I'm getting close to leveling up again when I get that level 21. And I've heard from multiple sources that uh, the best setup for the AS50 is using two attachments with extended mags and the uh, variable zoom. I've heard that from a few different people, actually. So I do want to actually get the variable zoom and try that out, see how effective it actually is. It kind of makes sense, because this has a lower scope zoom, which actually can be good for clo quick scoping and close range. Having a lower scope zoom can be kind of useful for close range quick scoping, but of course it removes your ability to snipe people at long range, or it doesn't remove it, but it makes it a little harder to snipe people at long range with a such a low scope zoom. So variable zoom would make sense because it gives you an even smaller default scope zoom as soon as you spawn in, it'll be even even smaller, which might be actually really good for close scoping. But then you can actually zoom it out to like uh, a normal scope zoom, which would be good for long range sniping. So I can actually imagine that being pretty good. And two headshots in a row. Nice. Oh crap, people, people. Ah. Sheesh, I just no scoped him. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, I'd have to look at that again. That might actually be like some kind of montage clip or something because that was. I, I don't even know what just happened. All I remember is headshot, headshot, no scope, no scope, headshot. That, that's what I remember. I don't even know, man. <laughs> I, I really would have to look at that again. That would actually be pretty cool. I'm just amazed that those no scopes hit. I mean, even though it wasn't, like, super range, I mean, it's kind of, you know, unlikely to hit two no-scopes at that range in a row. From that range, at least. And it's not like a barrel stop no-scope, no. No, it was actually some kind of range, at least. So, hey, whatever. Nope, 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 failing. Nope. <laughs> Get wrecked. <laughs> Isn't that just happened, man? I just, like, totally turned on that guy and no-scoped him. Oh, my gosh. Well, my no-scopes are definitely working, but my uh, aim is still not perfect, as you can see. <laughs> I just missed that guy, but whatever. My no-scopes are just doing beastly right now. Oh my gosh. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Ah, stupid glitch. There's apparently some kind of glitch where you can actually get stuck, like if you're laying next to something like that, you'll actually get like stuck under it or something if, you're, if I'm holding a throwing knife. I've noticed that actually happened to me a couple times. No, oh, get inside. Yeah. Surprised that didn't go for me. Oh, jeez. Nope, looks like we're losing B. What do you say we stop that from happening? Oh, she shit marker. <laughs> uh, nice. Got all hit markers. Alright. Let's see if I can do anything amazing right here. Probably won't. Maybe I will. Yeah. Oh, that was amazing. Uh, did you see that epic, epic shot right there? Not really. There we go. Nope, sheesh. Okay, he's down there. I'm gonna drop attack insert here just in case he does kill me. Oh crap, yep. Oh, jeez, you little camping fag. 
Oh, assassin, you suck. <laughs> Why? Oh well, whatever. I mean, I just with that there too. It's just just my luck that he had to come up behind me like that at that exact moment. That's like so unlucky, so horribly unlucky. Sheesh. Okay, well at least I'm managing to go positive this game, even with my aim not being on. That was a great spawn kill by the Type 95. Look at that. Look at that beastly spawn. Long knife. Oh, 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 sheesh. Fail. <laughs> Fail. Oh, come on, come on, come on. I'm, I'm not doing good right now. Yeah, Come on, come on. Oh my gosh. My aim. Oh, my aim. Oh, wow, I didn't realize people were back there. Maybe if I throw a throw on that, I might hit somebody. Okay, I guess not. Couldn't hurt the try, though, right? Oh. Man, okay. Going on a death streak now, I was going pretty good positive, and now I'm just getting spawn killed and going on big death streaks and all that stuff. So, yeah, okay. This is kind of sucking. Of course, you know, the great Modern Warfare 3 spawns have to keep making things tough for me, right? Sheesh. Yeah! What? That looked like it went in him. Oh, what is that? Death streak or something? What? Type 95. Get out of here, you little douche. I swear, that went in him. That bullet went in it. Oh, that. Yeah, I, I thought that went in him. Maybe I missed. I very well could have. Who knows? He's got a Type 95 anyway, so I have no respect for him. Yeah. Oh, gosh. What's with all the Type 95s? Get wrecked. I really don't like that weapon. It's very annoying. Oh, gosh. There we go. Um, let's try to go over here. And hopefully not die from some random noob with a Type 95 or something. Yeah. Oh, sheesh, that went in you. Okay. Whatever. Not really. That I actually did go in you. I want to kill. I want a refund. My bullet went in him, but I didn't get a kill. I want a refund for my bullet. Oh, I know it was a throwing knife, wasn't it? I don't know. I forgot what I killed him with. He didn't die, though, but I killed him with it. Even though I killed him with it, he didn't die. I think it was a throwing knife. I want a refund for my knife. But I threw into him and it vanished. He ate my knife. That was, like, that was an expensive knife. I want that back. Throwing knives are not very cheap, you know. So, yeah, I want a refund. Oh. Yep. Yep. Headshot. I'm well, sure I'm getting a lot of headshots this game. Okay, there we go. Oh, sheesh. So many people. How? How did I not hit him? It looks like I should have hit. Okay. Maybe it would be a good idea to drop this down here again. Or maybe that would be a bad idea. I don't know. I'm not entirely sure at this point. Sheesh. Range. Okay, that was a good idea, then. Dropping down here might be a bad idea. But I'm doing it anyways. Since he already knows where I am, probably. Oh my gosh. Sheesh. No, I scored a drop or something. That's, that's not good. I don't like that. Overpowered support streaks. Rescuer? What? That guy was about to kill somebody? He didn't look like it. He looked like he was just sitting there AFK. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad. Maybe that's where the variable zoom would be very useful. I could just pull out that longer scope zoom and actually hit somebody at that range. Also, my aim is not very good right now still, I think. Oh, sheesh. Wow. MP7. Cool. Not really. Not, not cool. Nope. Oh. Nope. Oh. Yeah, you suck. Alright.
Oh my gosh, great, great, just, just spawn kill me. Sheesh. Oh great, that's gonna tag all of us. And my teammates are just like crowding in here. Yeah. Alright. I hate how recon drones blind you, they're annoying. Okay, EMP. Great. Newbie support streaks. Every other enemy team's just using all these support streaks, and it's annoying. Sheesh. Stunting grenades. Nope. No, oh, sheesh. Ah. Assist. Oh my gosh. Wow, through the wall. Thank you, lag compensation. Let's see how long we have on this EMP. 27 seconds. Wait. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. oh, so many people. Oh my gosh. Ugh. Yeah. Random nose come through the wall. Whoa, I just took damage through the wall. Yeah. 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 Okay. Just random. I thought I'd try that. Because I don't really see anyone. I'm just shooting. Okay, I see someone. I see you. Oh, there you go. Oh, yeah, yeah. So many people. Get away. What am I stuck on? Ah, uh, table. <laughs> Wait. Okay, whatever. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of guys over here. A lot of people. Whoop. There you go. Nice little cross map there. Eh? Yeah. Ah, sheesh. I thought grenades were supposed to be bad in this game. That looked kind of far away from me. Sure, it was damaged, but still. I don't want to die from that. Sheesh. Okay, hey, I went positive. <laughs> Amazing. Well, that was a very uh, eventful game. Yes, that was eventful from most definite meanings of the word, most definitions of the word that fits the definition of eventful quite quite well, I think, yes, <laughs> so even though I didn't get a good score, uh, hey, I didn't go negative anymore, and uh, my aim is starting to look at least a little bit better than before, starting to get my aim back, uh -huh. most throwing apples, okay, my skills are lower rank, whatever, most of these, uh -huh. Support streaks, okay. Whatever. At least I wasn't using overpowered support streaks like EMPs and stealth bombers and uh what was that other thing? Escort airdrops and all that stuff. Uh yeah, so let's see how long this episode's gone. It's probably kind of long because dominations usually last pretty long. Um yeah, yeah, it's long enough. Alright. Well, uh, I hope you enjoyed that very eventful gameplay. I'm gonna to go look at my recording a little bit and just look at all that weird stuff that happened. And, uh, yeah, so I'll see you next time.